So I'm finally back down here in Mexico with um with Bluey. This is his truck. I haven't gone that far up in the world just yet. But shit, we've got an adventure plan. Cold weather. Cold changes coming. And that's a good thing. Adventures aren't fun unless they're um if they're too easy, you know, we can't have that at all. But I haven't shot a Samba since last November. Bluey, when was the last time you shot a Samba? Last year. Alright, too long ago. I'm gonna fix this. First brown bugger I see, I'm gonna pull the trigger on. And with any luck, full week, you can get some bone. Bit of antler. What do you reckon, Bluey? You got a 28 inch here in you? Yep. Well, we knew that, but can you shoot a 30 inch Samba? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Good times are fucking natural. Here comes that weather. It's good to be all set up, sorted. We'll go for a little afternoon wander. See if we can get a meat animal. We'll just see what's going on. Cold and wet, we're gonna move spots. No hunting today. Well, nice early start. There was a bit of snow last night. I was walking back from the from the hunt. It was just sleep. I was just soaked from rain for about an hour. But I got honked on the way out, which is fucking rad. Still a bit of snow on the ground, but with any luck we'll actually stay clear today. Finally got the chance to meet up with a hill dog, which is fucking rad. <laughs> and what's the only logical thing to do? Fucking go for a hunt. Well, have a coffee first and go for a hunt. Good times, I can smell them. Look, this is a new experience for me. The track should show up really well. Look at this. Fucking winter one land in every direction. I love it. New times, new experiences, new good times. So the hill dog and I are going to go up a track for a while and just to see what's going on. Oh. Found a few native tracks. But other than that, I'm just enjoying, I'm just loving this fucking winter wonderland. Got a little bit of blue coming over there. We'll actually have a fine day. Fuck, this is mean. This is rad. It's really hard going in the snow, like, this is totally different. I don't want to let it affect my confidence, I just want to enjoy the day, but that helps finding an old wallow. Um, occasionally I'm finding tracks, but moving through the thickest shit, I mean, you just can't move through that. <laughs> I mean, we can, but not effectively. So much of it. But um, I'll just do my best. It's starting to open up a little bit over here, and I'll just look for some sign. And just keep having fun. Well, I just put up four Samba real close. And then I found I've got a little friend down here, he's chilling out. Oh my God, he's cute. I really don't want to stress him out too much. Oh my God. It's hard not to go and say hello, look at him. He's fucking gorgeous. Oh, but he's tasty too. I don't know what to do. Oh, 
but I still had Samba baby. After about four hinds and some two young ones got up and burst off all in a group, which was really cool, but you run into the thick stuff. But yeah, it was nice catching up with that young one. That was cool. Well, last afternoon, I've just done a good sit and wait on a wallow back there for about an hour. And um, I did see one on hind, busting up the creek line before. And But um, yeah, haven't got a deer this trip. That's, that's all right. The Samba have humbled me. You know, I think I came in here a bit cocky. I thought I, I really knew how they worked. And I, I'm, I'm very pleased to be proven wrong. They're, um, my respect for them is only greater. And my lust to hunt them is even stronger. So I'm going to have to come back in a few weeks, I think. And uh, get my fix. But hey, there's still 20 minutes of daylight left. So I'm going to walk back along the fringe and I'm going to get out of here. Good times are natural people. Happy days. Hey, look. I might be coming back from Victoria Dealers. But um, it's still one of the best hunting trips I've ever had in my life. I want to say a massive thank you to Bluey, Dale, Andrew and Reese. Guys, thanks so much for having me along on your trip. Um, can't wait to hunt with you again in the future. If I've taken anything out of this week as well, I've learnt so much about Samba Deer. Um, just the moment I thought I knew anything, I've just had the biggest education in my life. And I'm glad I didn't get one because I want to hunt them more now. Like, my desire to, to kill one in the next few weeks is stronger than ever. And the need is stronger than ever. Um, so that's a great thing. But this June long weekend, uh, which is tomorrow, um, I'm heading down to Noe's and going fishing with a guy called Tom. And seems in school, so it's going to be fucking rad. Good time for natural people. See you later.